Everybody's heard of Thailand, located in Southeast Asia, 70 million in population, and you could say that their economy is largely dependent on tourism to stay afloat. When people usually think of Thailand, they think of a vacation paradise. Elephant sanctuaries all over the country, countless beautiful temples to go explore, 40-foot tall statues of Buddha, and of course the remote beautiful beaches. They also have highly developed infrastructure in the massive city of Bangkok. But what most people don't see is the extreme poverty and how harsh the living conditions really are for some people. So behind me here is a labor camp. People actually live in these little huts, these little rooms. I'm gonna walk around and check it out a little bit. And then everything here used to be like a really thick little jungle with a lot of like, trees and flowers and stuff and they bulldozed it and I guess they're just going to steamroll the, all this garbage and then when they develop the next building they'll just uh, build it right on top of the trash. <laughs> the foundation right on top of all the garbage. So these are the numbers here you can see on the rooms 25, 26. And then right now everybody's at work because they a truck comes and picks everybody up in the morning and then they go do labor. Yeah, this place is not really a good spot to live. Oh shit. I guess it makes you thankful for what you have. Got a few people still here. There's some puppies. And then there's a little restaurant here and one other little restaurant here. This is kind of my regular hangout spot because I lived at Laguna 3 for a while over here in that, in that condo building for like mm, about a month when I first got to Pattaya. And then stayed at a few other condo buildings, but I don't know. They got really cheap beer here. They got good food. It's part of the labor camp, but um, the, the owner and her boyfriend, they're living a little bit more comfortable definitely than the rest of the workers in the labor camp <clears throat> her boyfriend's an engineer and she just hangs out and cooks food and gets drunk and yeah it's a good kicky spot they got some couches you know and since i'm here every day it kind of it's kind of become a little bit more normal i guess um yeah i still feel bad for the people that are living in these conditions the there's no bathrooms in any of the rooms. There's like a communal bathroom. I'm not gonna go in there, but um, yeah. And then a communal shower. They make around, I think, uh, seven or eight dollars per day. So definitely hard to live off of, even in Thailand with how cheap stuff is. But yeah, I'm just showing a little sample of the poverty out here because some people don't know that the extreme poverty exists.